What's up Transformers fans, this is Stan Sears and in today's video I'm going to be reacting and also break down this new clip that has come on yesterday. Now this one I found is called Hot One. Now I know there's some other videos of the same thing that's got a different name to it but um, but I might, I don't know, I might call this video the name Hot One but anyway, let's just watch it anyway so we'll see what I, what I think of it and then we'll break it down and well, give my thoughts about it. So let's watch it. Bumby and Cop Copman. Whoa! We have guests! Oh! Oh! That's true. Right. Hmm. Here he is, Hot Wad. I do so love the perfect timing. Hmm. I'll be talks. He talks? <laughs> Ooh. Whoa. <gasps> Ooh. Whoa. Oh, I that that was um that was pretty good. Um, didn't expect the um, trailer in the end of that video. Well, I didn't expect like a mini trailer kind of thing to it, but so let's see what I could see from here then. So this has to be some point in the middle of the film when Cade, Bumblebee, and Cop. Well, I say well, obvious Copman's from England, but uh, let's say Bo well, Bumblebee and, and <coughs> Cade. This must be the point when they go to London, you know, to learn about the secrets of why they keep coming here. And I love um, Sir Edmund, who Andy Hawkins plays. I'm sure I said his um, character's name right. And we got uh, that Dimension Robot tank. <laughs> That's really funny. Now, I heard rumours about that tank's name before. Um, I can't remember in my head, but if I do find out what his name was again, or if they didn't reveal it, I will let you guys know about that one. So, uh, Cartman, Cartman looks good. Uh, I love the design of Cartman, like, he's a mini, you know, he's because he's a headmaster. Uh, I love the, um, as I said before, I love the uh, mouth play that he's got in his uh, mouth. I know I already said he, what I think about him before when they first revealed him, but I'll say that again, he, he does look good. Now, the, the um, tank, um, he does remind me of similar with Jetfire, because he's saying his pieces are falling off. It's like Jetfire, because Jetfire had pieces coming off of him. So, I wonder if he's like the same as Jeffro, like he's very, very old and, well, he has to be with if he's got wobble dementia. And, you know, parts coming out, so I say he's old. But, I hope at one point, I hope he doesn't turn on the other bots if he isn't part of the battle, you know, facing Decepticons. Because that will, oh, excuse me, that will be a bad situation then. Because if he's attacking his own brothers, you know, his other bots, that, that's going to make the Decepticons thing like... Oh wait, is he on the outside or is he not? <laughs> but who knows? Maybe he's part of the battle. I don't know. And Bumblebee, I love Bum uh, Bumblebee. <laughs> I can't believe his radio. He goes like, "What the hell?" <laughs> I'm sorry, I wonder what film he used from that. Ah, oh. okay, yeah, yeah. Ah, oh. it was funny in this one. I love it when he goes like, "Look, if you don't start talking, I'm walking out of here." <laughs> and I love it when anti well. Anti Hawkins character, Ed, Sir Edmund, when he goes like, dude, I'm like, whoa, okay. And then, here we go, Hot Wad, we get our first, well, his first appearance. And uh, Laura Harrick's character. I'm still not pretty sure what her character's called again, but this bit looks funny. And is, is White, what they said about Hot Wad's uh, asset, you know, I mean, he's talking. He does have a French accent, a French language to it. 
Because he don't he does speak English, but he's got the sound like a French person. I really love that. I thought first when I heard that I was like, oh, he's not gonna be good, but from that he sounds perfect. I love it when he's hang on, I'm gonna play that bit again when he says. <laughs> I love it how he says that. Little lady, no! <laughs> that is so funny. Oh, oh. That's good really, because I can fit because really, well, I couldn't see like his mouth movement, so I'm wondering does his mouth move his well, because I know he's got like a no mouth, but I'm wondering if that bit like moves or it doesn't really move and you you don't well that's what I'll say. And I love this bit here, Cotman's holding uh, Sir Edmund's dog. So looks like he keeps an eye on the dog as well. Okay with that bit. I love when he says like so is this a first Transformers experience or is this a kidnapping? <laughs> Oh, I want to hear again. I want to hear the next one. What what says? Let's hear that again. She's very difficult. <laughs> That's cool. She's very difficult. <laughs> I am looking forward now with Heart One. That's got me more exciting for Heart One. Now, please and Lord, I hope they don't kill him off. I hope he survives so he can become one of his prime. I hope he does, and I hope he does have a lot of moments because they did say that. He was brothers in arms with Bumblebee, so I think I've, well, I'm sure I've said that I've said this before, but I'll say it again. I hope we do get a lot of scenes with both of them together. You know, they they're shooting guns to get together. You know, they're like like a brother thing, like a back to back kind of move. Like Bumblebee's firing, you know, hot wads behind him, and you know what I mean. When they're starting off, so I hope they do. I hope there's a moment like that, and I hope they do really work together a lot because I do want to see that. Because when they said they're brothers at arms, that got me saying, we're going to see that a lot in the film, but hopefully we do. If not, I hope in the next Transformers film with both of them, oh, they can put that more. Then the rest of the trailer just plays scenes we saw before. Like the ship rising off in the water, an extended bit with Bombi, when you actually do see Bombi hitting Optimus' head. Um, we got a bunch of people with a shield around them. EC, a fight with Megatron, well... Galvatron, I still love to call him. And in that bit, I think you can see Arthur's his eyes are blue or purple still on that bit. Uh, I can't really make out. Um, K firing the gun. A lot of stuff going on. Now, there was one bit I forgot to mention when I did me react, well, talked about the third trailer. Now, in this bit, you see Megatron, and he's got his, well, Galvatron. You, I know I keep saying Galvatron, but it's just what I love to call him. I know you see him like the disposal behind him and he gets his cannon out and he's by the Chicago bit where uh, Canopy dies. Well, I got me thinking about that one and I think maybe Canopy doesn't die, he survives. But then when Ma when he comes along, you know, Megatron slash Galvatron comes along, maybe he finishes, he finishes him off. I don't know, but that's what I got my theory on. And uh, the ending's um, good. It's just the... What I've said before, where Optimus slices those Infernicons heads off. That looks pretty good. And, wait, well, yeah, that's it. That's all from this um, video on this um, clip. So, uh, if you do want to see the, um, well, the clip, also that also trailer attached to it, I will leave the link down in the description below so you can find it. Also, my Transformers Facebook page, that'll be down in the description below. Uh, after watching the video, leave your comments below. Uh, what do you think of the video? Uh, uh, give your thoughts. What do you think of Hot Wads' um, friend's ass uh, talking? Do you find it good? Do you think they should have kept this kind of voice he had in the anime film? Or, or are you not bothered? Please put that down in the, description, the comments below. Also, give it a thumbs up. Uh, send this out to your friends so I can get more viewers and subscribers. And if you're new, this is what I do. I do Marvel and Transformers Cinematic Universe news. V uh, clips, reaction, and TV spots. Clips when they when I can manage to they come around, I can do it. TV spots when the films did close out, I don't bother with that because you know they tend to spoil us. Oh, and also one last thing before I to tell you about the other videos. Uh, I've heard now from the um, Transformers, it's uh, they've moved the release date. I thought to remind you guys, uh, it's on the twenty first now in June, so that's a Wednesday. I thought to let you know. I think that's the same for the UK as well, so, and for all the countries who are, who have got that date, so I just want to say that. 
And last but not least, if you want to see my last Transformers video, well, click here. Me channel, just click here. Make sure you click the bell so you can be, you know, the first ones to be noticed about it. And here to click me last Marvel video. Well. And so that's it, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this reaction video. Thank you for watching. See you again soon. Peace.